You can't keep us in here! <coughs> Open up! I will tear you fuckers Stop apart with my bare hands! We gotta find another way out of here! <coughs> you oh, shit! <coughs> fucking bastard! <coughs> Open this door, goddammit! I will knock the goddamn Please, Dad, door down! Stop. It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet... Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee, we gotta get out of here! If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches! Get us out, you sons of bitches! Dad! This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. You're worse than the walkers! Dad, please. Don't give up. We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. Please settle down! I'll, I'll rip your goddamn heads off and make you swallow them! Salt licks. Pretty heavy. You think we could heave it through the door? Nah, door's too solid. Come on, try yourself. Coward. Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention so I can fucking kill them! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? You refuse to give me my day's rations back at the motor lodge. And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. But guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn... I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. No, you're not worth the energy to hate. Don't forget, I know who you really are. There's more of us on the way! Let us out now, if you want to live! Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! They're not gonna open the door! It got caught you and you duck, Lee! Those fuckers have my family! I know! Right I'm gonna get out of here and find them! Could this there be a hole healthy. behind these pallets? No such luck. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, Easy! Uh, oh, God. Dad? No! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead! What has to happen when... Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, 300 pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! Good morning later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! We can't kill him if he's not dead, Kenny. Remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size. It's him or us. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. Lee! Is he breathing at all? No. No, I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! One, You're putting two, all of us at risk, you three. son of a bitch! You're fucking worthless, Lee. Fuck!
Jimmy, I'm sorry. What the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! Are you okay? Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. I know, I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad, don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. I'm sorry, Lily. I truly am. Larry and me, we might not have got along so great, but I know he would have done anything to protect you. He was a good father. <laughs> Sorry, Lily. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. Do you have a coin? Mm -mm. Please, I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor end, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Huh. He still carried his wallet. A ring. My mother's. Don't worry. I'm not taking it. Two quarters, and a dime. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. <laughs> well, there's our way out, Lee. 
Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. They can just walk right out. <laughs> He's inside. He's not coming down. down. See where he is now. What do you see? Oh, sick fucker thinks this is a game. See where he is now. Lee, talk to me. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. See where he is now.
See? You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. Mark never volunteered to be food! You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like you didn't kill Jolene. You don't have... I'll keep Clementine safe. Too long. They attacked us! I knew it. I told you we couldn't trust them. Shit! How many of them are there? Two left. Where? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us! Shit! Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. No, no, Lee, no, no, no! Get shut up and you'll be fine. Oh, uh, I'm gonna take the boy and check around. No, please don't take my boy! Let's go, woman. Down. I don't want to hurt y'all. Andy? Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Yeah, it's me. Oh. Come here. Let me go! Lee, hit back! Don't come in here! You just had to go snooping around, didn't you? Go, Brenda! Come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Stop right there, I mean it. Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Stay back. Go, Brenda. Please, let's do it. I'll do it. Please. I don't want to kill you, Lee. Please don't make this any worse. Just stop. Don't shut up! Ah! 
Who the fuck do you people think you are? Look at what you've done! Shut the fuck up. You think I'm playing here, boy? All we wanted was gas! We came to you peacefully! Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know, 
glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah, and Clementine almost ate some. But... I stopped her. I can't leave her alone, Carly. This fucking world now. It's hiding just unspeakable shit at every turn. Katja managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <clears throat> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hon, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? You murdered Larry. Fuck you, man. You're alive because of me. Why didn't you have my back? I saved your wife and kid. No, I saved them. By making sure Larry didn't kill us. I couldn't do it, Ken. Well, maybe we should stay out of each other's way for a while. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, did you have to kill those men? I'm sorry you had to see that, but I only did it to protect us. Because they tried to hurt us? Yes. Okay. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Don't shoot! We're here to help! Figures. Oh, crap! Baby, you gotta see this. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. Well, what if it's not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but it's not about right and wrong anymore. It's about survival. It's locked. No shit, I already tried that. But I heard you take the keys from up front. Supplies? I'll pick it. More food in here. Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all.
Duck, why don't you carry this? Okay. Got a box of food here. I'll carry it. This hoodie looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. We're not like the bandits, honey. We didn't hurt anybody to get this. Understand? I guess so. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna want to see this. Oh, shit. Safe. I promise. 